primary arms did a wonderful job. They got me a scope back within a week. So we're essentially starting from zero today. We're gonna mount the scope, go to the range and zero it. And next weekend, we're gonna take it down to a long range place, a long range shooting range in Price, Utah and go to a thousand yards. Okay, I'm ready to start tightening slowly but surely. We've got a level on the action, top of the turret, and just let that bubble up, up to make sure. I'm just going to start tightening down to, I think it's 15 or 18 foot pounds. But, like with the tire, you just cross torque. You don't just tighten every one down. <clears throat> Gradually crisscross pattern. This primary arm, you did a zero, five shot group, half inch group, and then did a box test. I measured that and did it home. Seems to be tracking maybe within half an inch. I like it. Okay, I want to go over these targets now. We're using Barnes 175 grain match burners, 2650, and a 308 Savage 10. Got the primary arms remounted today, 4 to 14, with the 308 reticle in it, the HUD reticle. So here is my five shot zero. It's about a half inch, 0.625 at 100 yards from the bench, bipod in a bag. And then I did a box test. So I came over one mil to here. And interesting, it came a little bit lower because I was aiming at the same spot. But it came about three and a half inches to the right. I came down two mils to here. And then that measured seven and an eighth inches. I came left two mils to here and it was seven and a half inches. You notice, I mean, a quarter inch below the line, barely right on the line. But I came up two mils, here measured seven and an eighth inches from here to here. Came back right one mil, and I came in right here, one shot, just a little bit lower than my zero. That last shot came in about three quarter inches low, three quarters of an inch low, and half an inch to the left. But still within a minute, or pretty close to an inch of being back to zero. I did not move the turrets. I went back to here to zero, and you notice it's a little low and left. Here's a five shot group again. Nice tight group. I moved up two clicks, so about three quarters of an inch. Came up, still hugged the left, had four shots here. And this is probably half inch, three quarters of an inch group. And I was still hugging left here. But oddly, I just moved one click over and one click down, and it didn't quite split the difference. But uh, so I was here to here for these two shots, here and here. So I moved back one click up and one click left. Came back up, let the barrel cool. Was aiming here, ended up just a little high tiny bit high so that one click it's probably tracking more accurately than I can actually shoot 
because here's three, four, and then I click down one, four, five. So I need, that. for my final zero, I just moved it back one click, and I'll just call it good. Anyway, primary arms, four to 14. Accuracy, box test, came out very well. I mean, really everything's within a quarter, two and a half inch. More accurate than I can shoot. Hope that helps somebody. Couldn't be more impressed with the customer service at Primary Arms as I had one on the, the Savage 10 and it broke. I had a new one within a week and uh, put it back on today and, and it's performing exceptionally. Hope that helps somebody.